with Conan O'Brien. Tonight, from the movie, my boss's daughter, Andy Richter, Marilyn Manson, and former WWE wrestler and author, Mick Foley. With the Mac Wiper 7, now, here's your host, Conan. Someday I'm just gonna do that for an hour. <laughs> See what happens. Ha, hoo, ha. Then men in white coats will come and take me away. <laughs> Boy, uh, tonight's a great show. I say that every night. I never really mean it. I'm just trying to get through the hour, but tonight we have a great combination, right? We have a killer combination, an amazing sandwich tonight. A triple decker sandwich. You'll see what I'm talking about. So many great things to discuss here at the top of the show. Man, if this is possible, it's getting crazier in California. That place is retarded now, I believe. <laughs> I mean, they just really are. It's just... The whole state of California... You've seen my impression, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's my impression of the state of California. It's gone mad. Well, it's getting even weirder now. It's been reported that some of Arnold Schwarzenegger's opponents have been circulating naked pictures of Arnold on the internet. That's right. Yeah, true story. Yeah, in a related story, Arnold is leading the other candidates by four inches. Get it? <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger has hired billionaire Warren Buffett as his senior economic advisor. His latest move. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, not to be outdone, Gary Coleman has announced that his senior economic advisor will be Thurston Howell III. <laughs> hop out. Off the island now. This is a weird story, in ca in, uh, also in California, one of the candidates running for governor, because I think there's a lot of them, one of the candidates running for governor is a 100-year-old woman. Woo! That's the latest. Yeah, good for her. Yeah, the 100-year-old says she'd like to recall Governor Gray Davis, but more importantly, she'd like to recall where she left her teeth. <laughs> well, apparently she's not in the race anymore. <laughs> now... Oh. Oh. I'm on the edge. <laughs> a company has come out with a George Bush action figure. George Bush action figure that commemorates his landing on the aircraft carrier earlier this year. Yeah. Yeah, the company says by posing Bush and making him talk, kids can get an idea what it's like to be Dick Cheney. <laughs> and, uh, I thought... I'm always confused by that reaction. <laughs> kind of like, hmm, we don't love it, but yes. <laughs> we agree. <laughs> yes. Like I introduced a bill and we've considered it and we pass it. <laughs> tum, tum, tum. <laughs> Gotta mention this before I go. Christina Aguilera and Justin Timberlake were forced to cancel a week of shows because during rehearsal, a giant scaffold collapsed. <laughs> yeah, it's still collapsed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, neither singer was injured, but workers promised to try again next week. <laughs> Yay, all right. <laughs> Yay, people injured. Uh, the meanest crowd I've ever met. La, 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 la. All right, we have such a good show tonight. We have such a good show. We really do. Uh, my old friend has come home. That's right, the prodigal son returns from the movie My Boss's Daughter. Andy Richter is here. <laughs> Don't make sense of all this madness. He's here, and he brought cash. All right, uh, also, second guest tonight, currently on the OzFest tour with his new CD, The Golden Age of Grotesque. Love him, fear him, Marilyn Manson's on the show. I love this show tonight. Andy, Marilyn Manson, it's the way it always should have been. And, uh, of course, you used to know him as Mankind, one of the all-time greats of professional wrestling. Mick Foley's here to round out things. Show. Right over here, a Jimmy Bavino on the Max Wine with today. show tonight. You know, it's nice. I don't know if you, you feel the same way, Jimmy, but when, whenever Andy comes back, I wouldn't really, he's been gone three years now, almost. Whenever he comes back, I feel like he never left. Like, he's here in the hallway, and it just all feels like, yeah, this is the way it always was. This is the way it is again. Do you get that same uh, feeling? He's, he's family. You know? Yeah, it's family. Yeah. He's like, comes home. It's such yeah. a nice, nice thing. I feel the same way about Marlon Manson, too. Whenever he's here... <laughs> Because he was a sidekick on the show for the first three <laughs> yeah, years. Yeah, and the Manson yeah, family. And they, yeah, and the network got mad because we had blood coming out of the walls. <laughs> Big babies. That was my vision, and they cut me down. <laughs>